and welcome back guys, so we're going to be playing some more Fable 3 now. I uh, hope everyone's enjoying this series, it's definitely different. I was not expecting some of the things to it that we saw in this game just so far. Oh, there are some cringy moments, there are some very unexpected moments. Yes, this is a very strange game. Anyways, make sure you hit that like button, thank you guys for supporting the channel. Let's do some more gameplay of Fable 3. Hello, I've just learned yet another remarkable tidbit from the Book of Heroes. It seems that you have the power to upgrade not only your living weapons, but also any weapon you find. Come back to the Sanctuary, and I can show you how. Cease your movement! Be you men or be you hollow men! Have you gone daft, boy? Open up the doors! Walter? Is that you? The very same. Now, are you going to let us in or what? Right, yes, of course. Open the gate! Tell Major Swift, Walter's here! Welcome, Sir Walter. Sir. There he is. The one and only, Major Swift. Oh, oh Walter! What the blazes are you doing here? We came looking for you. I have a proposition. You came all this way to proposition us. And I thought you were here to save us from the legions of the damned. Ben Finn, it's good to see you. I take it the legends about this place are true then? I'll say. You've never seen so many hollow men in one place. We've been stationed here for weeks, trying to eradicate them. Mainly, it's us getting eradicated. We lost some good men last night, including Lieutenant Simmons here. And the buggers will be back tonight. Logan just loves to send you on the best assignments, doesn't he? That's part of what I wanted to talk to you about. Is this... Uh... The princess. Yes. I'll explain. But just treat her like any other pair of hands for now. Fair enough. Captain Finn will show you to the mortar. We could use a, a body up there. Meet me on the wall when you're ready. I'll introduce you to Private Jammy. So cool because he's the luckiest sod in the fort. You'll probably be stuck by, by that mortar all night. Well, take a look around first. Talk to the men. It never hurts to know who's got your back. The old castle bar. Into the armory we go. Examine your new weapon to learn what you must do in order to improve it. But whatever it is, please don't do it in here. I've just tidied up. Pistols fire quickly and cause a respectable amount of damage among those who respect such such things. Hi. 
Long time coming, Major. Long time coming. Oh, my feet are killing me. So, I told you not to wear those princess. What's going on there, then? Let's see what we can do for you. Enjoy. Enjoy. Yeah, it may be expensive, but it's worth every ounce of gold. Finally, a little money coming into this town. A little's even coming through my door. I don't suppose you've ever used a mortar before? There's nothing to it. There's always a slight chance of maiming, of course, but um, I'm sure you'll pick it up. First, I'd like you to meet Private Jammy. He'll be your loader. Pleasure to meet you. It's true what they say about me, you know. Jammy is soldier in Albion. 724 wounds and still standing. <laughs> don't worry, you'll get used to him. After a while, he's hardly revolting at all. Right, Jammy. It's time to show her the ropes. Yes, sir. Right then. My life's gonna be in your hands, so let's make sure you you know what you're doing, okay? Go on, grab the mortar and we'll do some practice shots. Right, let's see what you've got. See that scarecrow over there? Blow it up. Yeah, that's right. Let's blow it up. Yes! Yes! Woo! Push! <laughs> Oh, goodbye, Mr. Scarecrow. That was bloody brilliant. All right, Jammy, don't get too excited. You know what happens when you do. Let's just take care of the last one. Just one left. Hang on. I don't remember setting this one up.
Simmons. I specifically instructed you to remain buried. Oh, doesn't anyone follow orders? <laughs> was pretty damn impressive. So, your father wasn't the last hero of Albion after all. We did it! No, really, we did! Let the poets tell our epic tale. The Swift Brigade fought against impossible odds. They won the end. Well, Sir Walter, you didn't do too bad for an old man. Neither did you, for a buffoon. <laughs> ah, that was just like old times, Walter. Just like old times. So, what do you say? Will you join us? With your help, we can put a stop to Logan's madness. Bring back the real Albion army. I swore to serve my king to the death. We all did. But this isn't the way it was meant to be. The old guard has been shoved aside, and these new soldiers Logan's been gathering, they don't care about this land or its people. Yeah, and I bet they get paid more. Walter has absolute faith in you. And after seeing you in action, so do I. All I ask is that you make a soldier's oath. Let your armies protect the people instead of oppressing them. 
Bring honor back to this uniform. Yeah, and don't forget the pay rise. Shut up, Ben. I promise. This has been a momentous day. With the support of Major Swift and his soldiers, the revolution grows in strength, and you move one step closer to becoming the leader this kingdom needs. Then it's settled. We're heading back to Bowerstone now. There are some people there I'm hoping will join us. We'll send for you when we're ready.
can I do for you then? Cheers, that's great. Come again? My goods are the cheapest, really they are. Question, or maybe you're just browsing. Thanks for coming by. You won't find tastier drinks than mine. That always been there. For that is someone weeks. special. This looks like a good place to stop. Make sure you hit that like button. Uh, thank you guys for supporting the channel. Uh, I'm going to kind of hang around here for a little bit, wait for the money to add up some more, and then probably buy some more houses and businesses regarding this game. Anyway.